All right, man. I do believe we are in for a blitz off of Dressrosa because Fujitora, we finally rolled something other than a one. But ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Bus. And today we are back in Dressrosa and it is starting to wind down. As far as the channel goes, we will only have three more videos total because in the section on Crunchyroll, it ends at 746. So we're basically there. We're basically at the finish line. And it feels so crazy to say because it has been without a doubt the longest arc slash journey in one piece thus far i guess aside from the entire paramount war but that was more divided up because it had like sabo odi impel down marine forward well this felt like the same length i'm pretty sure it is i don't know what is it on crunchy roll let me see summit war 132 this was longer oh no no no! this was 20 episodes shorter okay i can picture it though man dress rosa was freaking long but boy did i enjoy the heck out of it and we still have more to go we have more post-art goodness to get into last time we saw kaido for the first time it was insane but today we're gonna get into it if you're new to the channel make sure you drop a sub and let's get started dude the the one piece like sound of people running is like forever just like nailed into my skull i just pictured like the sound effects people like making little clopping noises on a desk the point switches to all ports how are we supposed to leave we don't even have sunny man fujitora wants no part of this I'm not shocked. I think he still feels conflicted about capturing Luffy or any of them that helped. <laughs> Dude, can Kanjiro just like draw a boat? Yep, need to find a ship. Uh, maybe Kiros knows. Oh, the Tontadas, actually. They could 1 million percent help. Dude, Leo still be in my goat, bro. Still. The civilians are worried about their hero. Bart! Oh, Bart would die for them. Let's go. The poor in the east. Dude, they're getting set up perfectly. Luffy's still eating, of course. Gotta recover somehow. Ah, Sai! Oh, dude, that giant is not hidden, man. Wait, but they're hiding and gonna try to help. But like, they're pirates too. They're gonna kidnap them, or not kidnap, capture the same. Like, the Navy sees all of them on equal level, just all being pirates. <laughs> Him grabbing the meat, bro. Let's go, dude. Is he? Dude, ask Bellamy to join. Luffy, please. Oh. Dang, at a boy law. So what? Grabbed him without even. Uh, he just knew he meant something to Luffy. Yeah, seriously. No, Law's right. He saved your life. And they're getting raided. Bro, just like this. Just book it east. They said. Dude, if this is where we say goodbye to Bart, I'm gonna miss him so much and his ability. The funny thing is, Fujitora has no part in this. He's delegated it. Oh. Luffy! What? Why is he stopping? The bone has flavor. This guy, man, I can't. Oh, didn't he say that last time? Like, that he had something to do? What, say his goodbyes? Oh, my. Even that aspect of you is cool. Somebody appreciates Zoro's lack of directions. Lack of navigation. How are they? Okay, I was about to say. I mean, their bullets wouldn't do anything either way. Where is he going? Go get Viola and be like, you want to go see Sanji? Hey, I got you. We so, we're so back, baby. The definition of we're so back. Oh. Oh, Viola's watching him. Spectating. Ah. Uh, I think he is going to see Rebecca. Fujitora's just spectating at this point. Oh, wait, maybe not. What? I thought you were living it up to him, man. This way, come here. I can't, bro. Oh, stop. <laughs> the sparkles around him. 
Yeah, they're straight up just booking it. Like, I thought it was going to be a little bit more meticulous. Just running. Who's watching over the eSport? They're taking it on every port. Oh, they... Oh, it's all the people from the Coliseum. So not just in the city. Dude, dude, Dress Rosa just became peaceful. There's like a war against the Navy now. Damn it, Dara. <laughs> Why do characters have like, is it like, I don't know what you call that. It's just like they add on random words, syllables, phrases onto the end. Is it just like a, a characteristic thing? Like, should I not think too much about it? Harudin! I want to see Harudin interact with freaking Dorian and Broggy. Gonna miss all these guys, all of our comrades, and Baby Five. Oh, Luffy's going to the. Yeah, he is going to the palace. They'll set him as a high priority too, I think. Oh, all the, the sunflowers. Wow, it's not my favorite island out of any single one, like every single one we've seen so far. I think Water 7 is still my favorite. Dressrosa is pretty high up there. Like the, the architecture of the buildings, the giant sunflower field, like there's a lot of aspects to it that I really like. It's probably in top three, maybe top five. I'm not sure. Fireworks? Oh, he's done that before, so it's both fists and feet. Luffy, calm down. They're just Navy soldiers. He's been punching above his weight against uh, against Doflamingo. Yeah, he is going to see Rebecca. Maybe he wants to question the entire thing with Kiros and like the narrative being made. Luffy, they are regular schmegular Navy officers, man. <laughs> She's gonna run to him. She wants to see him. She literally just said. There he is. <laughs> She's so excited to see him. Yeah, Rebecca, you get you have status. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> He's so aggressive, bro. I think he is gonna ask about Kiros and like what she wants. It's okay, he's a friend. Uh-huh. Yup. Yup. She'd never see him again? I mean, couldn't he just live in secret? What? I... Why? You said terrible things to him, but like, you didn't know he was your dad. It was just frustrations built up. She can't blame herself. They need to just talk to each other, like one-on-one, -on -one, father and daughter. Oh. <laughs> he didn't say no. He said, I don't know. Make sure she thinks about it, really asks herself. Mm -hmm. Oh, to go see him. Like I said, they need to just talk one on one. Oh, oh Luffy. Oh, goodness. What did Viola do? Or what's the favor? Maybe tell Riku what's going on? Yeah, probably. Probably explain it to him. All right, Riku. <laughs> Kidnap, bro. He asked permission. He's gonna hear that as Luffy's like, oh, that's okay. <laughs> uh, oh my gosh. Do they actually think he's like a villain, bro? How audacious! Come on, Gats. You know Luffy. And all of a sudden, the narrative is the narrative is right back. Luffy evil, pirate evil, Kaizoku evil. Sniper unit? He's still a freaking rubber man. They're just gonna hit Rebecca on accident. Like if a bullet hit Luffy's skull, it wouldn't matter, right? I don't think. What? 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 What the? Was it Tontadas? Color of the super? Yeah, hockey. I think it was Tontadas. No, Fujitora didn't. Wait, I'm assuming because like whenever we first were introduced to Tentatas, they were like yoinking stuff without us even seeing them. It's kind of, I feel like it's calling back to the very beginning. He's like, are we the bad guys? Zengo, is that a gorilla? Why is there a gorilla just sitting next to him? Dude, retired Sengoku might be my favorite character of all time. That guy is a chill viber. The definition of one. Is Kiros just still on the, the like the, by the house? The small house? Either way, not a not a whole lot going on in that one, but that's okay. We're, we're nearing the end. 742. 
Dude, there's no way the townspeople watch this man take down Doflamingo and they're taking brooms and pans to try to stop him. I guess they picture him actually like, like stealing their, their princess. But like, dude, do you actually think this is for no reason? She's just holding onto him for funsies? You goofballs? Oh. Oh my gosh. Who even is this guy? A vice admiral? He has to be, right? The music. Oh, they got like nets? Ah. Uh, yeah, I'm surprised they've been using like just regular bullets this entire time knowing what Luffy is. Yeah, now they're using like sea prism stone. <laughs> okay. Can't she just be like, yo, wait, I'm going with him for a second just to find something or something. I don't know. Come up with something, Rebecca. Jeez Louise, don't just stand there. I guess he's still a pirate. They, they just like, they just always see him as a pirate now. Like that's just, uh, it's so black and white. Hey man, they're asking for it, bro. He was he was fine going peacefully, all right? Accidentally drops Rebecca. She crushes her skull. The entirety of Dressrosa was pointless. <laughs> Lucy? That's my meat! Lu Luffy grabbing people's meat, running through a freaking hit and run, man? It is sweet in retrospect, though, like all the civilians running after him trying to save their princess. They all want to protect her. How gung ho they are about rebuilding this kingdom. The house she grew up. That's where he is. They're such a, an adorable duo, man. Luffy and Rebecca. Oh, man. I just know this, this, this freaking conversation is gonna be so emotional the gloves oh my gosh don't make me watch this again we used to put on gloves to hold her oh my gosh don't make me watch this again oh, oh my gosh <laughs> she breaks my heart he's taking them with him he really is just packing a bag he protected her Bro, his dad of all time, man. And now <laughs> Rebecca is gonna be right there. Oh gosh. Oh wait, where is this forest? This is on the Flowerfield Hill. <laughs> God, it's so cute, man. How are you falling right now, Rebecca? I oh, couldn't feel a damn thing. I haven't told you anything. Well, like about how much he means to her. She's gonna be right there. Don't tell me this is like a bait and switch or like she's too late and he's already gone. That will actually break my heart. They can live on this house together in the flower field. It's the dream! Wait, was it ever explained why the toys couldn't be in the same place at night as the humans? Am I tripping? Why did he not just stay at the same house with her? Like, I know it was like a law, but they were already outlaws. Am I stupid for not understanding? Or was that just a plot hole? Because there's no reason he'd obey just because it's a law, right? A chance at happiness. Well, that chance at happiness could be with him. There she is. Okay. They didn't bait and switch me. Oh. Oh. She said technically. <laughs> that shit is so sweet, man. That story really came full circle. How long we've known their story is just crazy. And that's really just like the, the closing of the chapter. What happens with like, the royal family then? <sighs> we'll never come back. Oh, that's what he, the favor. She knew the decision she was making. Oh my gosh. Yeah, they can't go back. 
Oh, shoot. Viola would be the freaking princess of Dressrosa. Oh, shoot. Sanji got begged a princess? Oh. I'm so emotional. Why? Fucking Zoro, why? I like how Zoro was like, I. He's, he's using it to fly. He's just dragging the gravity. That's sick. And now Luffy's trying to get back. Man, Isho will pincer. So he is uh, taking action. I figured, I think he said he didn't want any part of it. I guess he's leaving him in charge of this section. He wants to act alone at this point. Not alone, but like on his own accord with this whole overarching plan. Zoro looks hype, bro. <laughs> Dude, I would take a fight between them. Oh. Bro, Bart hopping in front of Zoro. They're all jumping in for them. Dude, so many comrades, man. It was the Tentatas. They yoinked all the bullets. Yeah. Is that guy looking in his pants? What the fuck? What? Did they take his balls? Hell yeah. W Tentatas. Oh my gosh. Leo, my goat. Oh my god. Dude, look at this Jiga Chad. Leo is him for real. They're getting bodied. The Zentatas are for real, like an OP folk. Oh my gosh, they've collected so much healing juices. They're paralyzing people, taking too much. That's why they're getting paralyzed. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I won't hesitate. Draw more. I love how she just like neutralizes anyone. She's so small. Why, man? Is he just gonna like take them all on? I don't know. Fujitora still confuses me a tiny bit. I still like him though. Sengoku! Oh! Wait, Law! Start talking. Wait, what? Why? What? He found out about Law. Older brother, mate. Oh, of course he would ask about Corazon. Oh my gosh. I didn't even think about that. He was special to even Sengoku. Oh man. Oh my gosh. Dude, the antithesis of Doflamingo. And that's when he found out he died. Wait, what was the lie that he told him? The one lie? Oh my gosh. Dude. Oh, he lied, telling him he wouldn't be on the... Oh. So that law would live. Oh, that's him putting the pieces together. That, that kid was law, I see. Mm. Dang, bro, I would not have ever even thought of them talking about Corazon because, I mean, the interaction we saw between the two over the phone when we did was very brief and it was very confusing, but it basically just, it was basically just like, hey, Corazon, Rosinante is in cahoots with the Navy. Like some way or form, he prioritizes the relationship with the Navy and law over anything with the Don Quixote family. Like there's nothing bad going on here. So it's no wonder that law would want to go over because he knew from the get go from a, as a child that he was close to, to Sengoku in one form or another. I wonder what this conversation will lead to though, unless it's literally just to be like, yeah, he was special to us and kind of have closure in this arc for Corazon or Rosinante. Because we, we have to have closure with certain things like that, like Kiros and Rebecca. And I feel like there they could share a very special moment where Sengoku, this, this previous fleet admiral who years ago would be like, capture law, like get him. Now as a more neutral 
standpoint, a more neutral sort of pawn is able to just sit and have this conversation. And I, th I think just reminisce on this person that was special to both of them. And I think that's really cool. I'm glad it's taking the time to do that. And then whatever Fujitora is doing, that guy is so confusing, man. Is it going to be a fight between him and Zoro? I don't know. I think Bart and all of them want to step in. But again, we're still blitzing off this island and we still don't even know what's happening with like Sanji and all of them. But guys, that's been it for my reaction of today. I hope you did enjoy. There will only be two more videos on the Dress Rosa Saga. Very excited to see how it all wraps up. Drop a like on this one. I'll see you next time. Peace, peace.